Hi, I'm Trin and in this video I contemplate on whether Jesus was selfish or not. Uh, now, in my previous video I spoke about the mindset of Jesus and through my research I found some uh, claims that Jesus seemed quite selfish. Um, so I decided to go through um, this topic uh, in this video. Uh, John 14, 6 says, Jesus answered, I am the way and the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. If you really know me, you will know my Father as well. From now on you do know him and have seen him. Matthew 10, 37 Whoever loves father or mother more than me is not worthy of me. And whoever loves son or daughter more than me is not worthy of me. When looking at these two Bible verses, I also consider Jesus to be kind of selfish at first. Uh, though if to look at it a bit deeper, you, you can get a better claims or understanding of what he may have meant with it. Uh, while in the New Age concept it is believed that uh, selfishness is something positive, that it means the vibrational alignment with oneself, and this is something where people should be aiming towards, um, to a better understanding of self and a better connection with self. A uh, teacher named Abraham Hicks has also said that for this you would need to know what the self is. And he has said that self is source, self is pure positive energy, self is worthy, self is clear-minded, self is healthy, self is full of vitality, self is eager about life. When you're selfish enough to care how you feel is when people call you selfish. And he does teach us um, about how to... Uh, get more connected to our own pure nature, to our own pure selves, that if we uh, get to know ourselves better, to get to know the self better, then we get a better connection to our own pure nature as well. This is what the New Age has been believing. Uh, now, after the verse where Jesus said, I am the way, he also said, John fourteen ten. Don't you believe that I am in the Father and the Father is in me? The words I say to you, I do not speak on my own authority. Rather, it is the Father living in me who is doing his work. Um, so in this way, we can say that he, did, he was not really that selfish because he was speaking from, uh, from the connection of, uh, with his Father instead of uh, his own mind when he was saying these words. Uh, so in my perspective, it just means that he was quite self-aware. Uh, instead of being, uh, being uh, rather selfish, he was just self-aware. And considering all the good deeds he did to people, um, he has not been depicted as a selfish person, even though at a first glance it may seem so. In contrast to New Age, the Bible does not support selfishness. It says in James 3, 16 to 17, For where you have envy and selfish ambition, there you find disorder and every evil practice. But the wisdom that comes from heaven is first of all pure, then peace-loving, considerate, submissive, full of mercy and good fruit, impartial and sincere. When Jesus gave commandments, he said, Mark 12, 31, the second is this, Love your neighbor as yourself. There is no commandment greater than these. And in Proverbs 11.25 it says, A generous person will prosper. Whoever refreshes others will be refreshed. Proverbs 11.2 When pride comes, then comes disgrace. But with humility comes wisdom. So it seems to me that the Bible speaks more about uh, selfishness that is full of pride when in New Age, uh, selfishness is considered to be more of a self-awareness than uh, full of pride. So that makes them a bit different um, in understanding. Uh, what do you think about this? Uh, leave in the comments below and like, share, subscribe and see you soon. Ciao!